Hello and thanks for watching this Acumatica video on how to cancel an order. So many times there's varying quantities and varying items on orders and a customer may decide to either back order these items and be patient with the delivery of these items but in other cases a customer may communicate with you and say hey you know what I, I got what I want so there's a few different things we can do here. So the first is take a look at this order uh, chocolate by design is the customer. There's a few quantities here, three and five, for this Acer laptop computer and this Lego set. We have a few options. The status of the order is open. So if we go over to actions, we can go over here and say cancel order. That's one option. When we do that, the status goes to cancel, and we can no longer perform other options here as far as shipping. But what we can do is reopen the order. We'll do that now so we can bring the status of this back to open. The other thing we can do is we can update the quantities. Now, this particular order doesn't have any quantities on shipment yet, so updating this to anything other than zero would not complete the order. So that's not going to help, but what we could do is we can ship some of this. Let's try and ship part of this order. And we'll update the quantities we're shipping here to just below what the original order was. Then we'll go and confirm the shipment. Now, if we go back to our original order, make this big, what we can see is a sales order with a status back order. That's because these items are on back order and we're waiting to ship them out. Now, Acumatica shows you the original quantity on the order, the quantity on the shipments, earlier this was zero, and the open quantities, quantities remaining. So to cancel this, again, we can go to actions and say cancel order. We can also go over and update the quantities. So if I go over here and I change this to two and I change this to four, matching the quantity on the shipments and I save it you can see now effectively there's nothing to ship so if I were to go to actions and I try to create shipment I get an error message because there's really nothing planned for shipment there's nothing left so let me change these quantities back not a viable option to reset the quantity but again, we could actions cancel the order, as you know. The other thing we could do, let's say the customer calls up and says, you know what, I do want the Lego piece, but the Acer laptop, I don't need the additional quantity one. What you could do is you could scroll over to the right. You can move these columns as you need to over, if it makes more sense. So we can move this column called completed over. And if I check this one, customer says, I'm completed with this one, I don't need any more. We mark that completed and save it. Now that item is completely satisfied and will also not be part of a shipment. So if we were to create a shipment now, you only get the quantity one of the Lego set. So that's how that works. Now if we delete this shipment and then go back to the order, you see we no longer have an open quantity because we marked this complete. Again, you can check and toggle this back and forth. The customer changes their mind. If I mark this one completed, now I have nothing to ship. As soon as I save this, you'll notice Acumatica marks this as completed. So by checking these options, you're completing these line items one at a time. Again, the other option is to cancel the order. Lastly, because the status of this order is completed, I can't uncheck these boxes. To reopen up this order, we would do that through the Actions menu, reopen up the order. Then we could make these modifications if the customer calls up and changes their mind. So that's how to manipulate an order, make changes to an order based on a customer's communication, 
Maybe they want to cancel the order after they placed it. Maybe they're not satisfied with the delivery time and you need to basically close out this sales order so that it's no longer open. And you can see Acumatica gives you a lot of flexibility here to do that. So that's it. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.